Well, good morning, everybody. Welcome to the vlog number 31. 31 vlogs, and I've made it this far. We can totally make 365, guys. I totally think so. Um, this weekend was kind of short, but the weekdays are here. These are the cash days, you know, the casual, the casual days where um, I do literally nothing. I'm going to be doing is I'm going to my college to take a test for college. Um, it's to see if I have to take another class, and I really don't want to take another class, but I really also really don't want to take a test, so... Mm, I guess I'll try, but if I get a bad grade, that's alright, I've already taken this test three times. school but to go home I'm very very tired but I have to go to Green Bay today and get my new glasses because my glasses fell in the lake when uh, the river when I was kayaking so these glasses are not good enough for me to be using all the time I mean they're okay I can see good enough to drive and stuff like that but it's like you can't read things on the board and all that crap but I can't I could but I have to like squint in there. I'm on my way to go pick up my glasses by myself. My dad's at work, so he said he can't make it tonight, but I still need my glasses, so I'm gonna go pick them up myself, I guess, and uh, order them. Hopefully I can get them tonight, I don't know, but uh, what you guys just seen was me get checking my mail. Uh, I'm trying to get my package for my lenses for this phone, and they're not here yet, so um, that's what I was going to look for. And they weren't there, so that's depressing. Hopefully they'll be here tomorrow. They said the 10th, today's only the 9th, so I guess they're not behind, yeah, like behind schedule. It took like two hours and they still could not fucking get me in to do things. I had to have my eye exam. That was bullshit. Then when I finally got in there, I get in there and it takes them like two hours to call my insurance company. And then I'm sitting there for like three hours. I was in there total. Three hours of sitting there before they could even order my glasses. So they get my glasses. <clears throat> They're like, oh, we'll, we'll, we'll get them all fixed up and ready to go for you in an hour. So I went to Best Buy, killed some time, I bought. A CD, yes, a CD of the weekend. The weekend's awesome. Jesse Priest ass person. He's a good singer, a good rapper. And I just like him. He's just a good person. I like his style and I like the way he is. So I bought it. Yes, I splurged a little. I know I should be watching money, especially after today. But if I found out that I won't be having to pay for my glasses, well, at least hopefully not. Most of it shouldn't be out of my pocket. It should be my insurance, which I guess was worth the four-hour wait because that would have been too. $100. And I don't want to pay $200. I'm going to open this and pop this bitch in. And I would play it for you guys, but I don't want to get copyrighted. And I like these vlogs. If it sounds like I'm not as excited today as I usually am, it's probably because I'm super sick and very tired. Um, like I have been. Hopefully you guys are liking a little bit of the quality of the vlogs going up um, by tomorrow when I get the new lenses. I was also looking at a Canon 80D. Here's a picture of the picture I took. 
um, on my Instagram. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, here it is. Go click it. Follow me. Um, yes, awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, yeah, I, I love Casey Neistat. He uses a Canon 70D uh, with a Rode microphone and a Gorilla tripod. Um, and I love it all. I love all his equipment that he uses. This is the quality and the freaking heavy. It's weight is so heavy. I don't know how he carries that like that. But um, yes, the, the build quality of that camera. I can see why it's almost. Uh, it's actually almost twelve hundred dollars. My new glasses. Nice. Oh my god, it's like seeing everything for the first time. It literally feels like 4K. I, oh my god, everything is so cool. I'm like looking at the shit that I've seen every single day for the past like five years, but for some reason it looks so amazing. I can see each nick in the road, each license plate from a million miles away. Oh, it's nice to see. And then uh, I also went to the mall and bought my swimsuit, my uh, flip flops, and all that stuff that I'll need for LA. Uh, I spent like $170 on clothes. So that all comes out of my LA fund though, so it's not like I'm just blowing money. Just ate supper, watching some Daredevil with Kegels. What up, Keith? Daredevil is rocking right now, so I'm gonna continue to watch this. Finished a Daredevil for uh, Netflix season two. We just got done with it, and oh my god, that was good. That is such a good show. I know it's kind of dark and you can barely see me, but yes. Just finished it. Outstanding show. Can't wait for season three. Now, uh, I'm going to watch a little bit of Milk in the Middle. And starting tomorrow, I'll start Game of Thrones so I can watch all that. I have 15 days before... Um, well, actually, I have like 28 days before I go to LA. So, I have 28 days to catch all the way up on Game of Thrones. Which I should easily do because I watched all of Daredevil in like a week. So, easy peasy. Watch this movie right here. Dope. It was actually really good. Um, really good. Yeah, it was actually very good. I was so impressed. Um, so now it's 9 o'clock. I'm going to go edit this video and go to bed. Good night, guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Remember to LCS below. I know I'm not doing the cut scene thing, but I got to split it up a little bit. Do things seem different. just had the idea to talk about this um, on my vlog um, I would never normally do this so if you guys are new viewers to my vlog don't watch this and say hey this person's talking about inappropriate things this is not something I will be doing on a regular basis but I, I, I feel the need to address this on my vlog about two days ago a day ago two days ago my uh, high school gym teacher got arrested and charged as being a pedophile or like a sex offender. Here's the story. So the story is that he was messaging some girl um, who he thought was a 15 year old girl and um, it turned out that it was actually an undercover cop and the cop told him to meet up with her and he got arrested. Right now, the whole thing is going down. Everybody at school is not supposed to be talking about it, but everybody is. Naturally, it's all over the news and the radio because I come from a small town, and this is big, huge news. Now, maybe if you live in bigger towns like L.A., Chicago, Illinois, I mean, like, any New York, anything like that, big places, this might not be big news. But for a small town like this, I feel like um, this needs to be addressed. And, like, that's really sick. That's really messed up. Why? Just, just, just why? I'm speechless. Like, that's so sick. And he's a gym teacher. That's disgusting.